In around four years of shipping TV, we have never looked at model ships before, so here's something new. Dennis Robotham's model of HMS Fearless was built over several years and launched back in 2011. She's still a work in progress, of course, with new features being added every year and an eventual plan to convert from electrical to live steam power. Speed turn to port any time you like, sir. So you built this from scratch? From photographs. From photographs? Yeah, that was still in service when I built it. The MOD wouldn't give me no information. I don't blame them, really. Uh, <laughs> but you got all the information in the end? Yeah, um, fortunately there was a guy that served on it, one of the uh, officers, and after they came back from the first Iraqi Gulf conflict, he sent me A4 colour photographs when right. it was moored up in Portland Harbour. And uh, he sent me all A4 photographs of it. And that's what I did it, made it to. That's you get it. all the detail that was on them photographs is on there. How long did it take you to do? Six years. Six years? Six years to make Were you retired at the time or still working? No, no, I still working. Still working? Yeah, still working. How, how old is she? How long has, has she been? Uh, that's been... That launched five five years ago. So she's been in service with you for five years? Five years, yeah. Excellent. Yeah. Ever since I finished, well, it's not finished really, it's ongoing all the time. <laughs> Last year I added 70 more lights on it, one over each of the doorways. Excellent. And when I first built it, I put um, tubes up the inside of the funnels ready for a steam plant to go in oh. later, oh, which really? I've still got to do. Are you planning to so do it? So it's all, all ongoing. You're going to put a steam in? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I pump six and a half gallon of water into a tank under the flight deck, which sinks the stern down two inches. Right. Open the stern door. Open the stern door, and then I'll bring the two landing craft out on separate controls. So I've only just got my replacement motor right. for the door to operate at the back. Right. But the two landing craft in the back there come out separately They're on separate controls. There's no way to control. Dennis, I suppose at the end of the day, you're going to have to put radio control on the helicopter. Well, <laughs> if you look now, look. Well, I think the ship does the same thing, doesn't it? Really?